and we are on. And you've got to be wondering, with a nickname like the Killer Whale, what sort of style would a Killer Whale have in a grappling? I mean, assuming they had sort of arms and legs and could do jiu-jitsu. Well, I mean, it's not the same as a shark. No. Okay. So. <laughs> Which is the more cliche jiu-jitsu mm -hmm. um, aquatic yeah, animal. Yeah. yeah or an yeah. octopus, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. I know. Instantly, Ella Dorkin going, trying to work this uh, Dele Hiba position and try and hand on the lapel. Possible option for a triangle here. So Ella Dorkin oh. is apparently an avid climber. So you can imagine her grip strength is going to be uh, pretty hard to break. Yeah, I mean, we're kind of seeing that already here. Mm -hmm. You know, very, very strong on the lapel and the sleeve here. You're more of the uh, gee grappler at the two of us, <laughs> Vanessa. It's been uh, quite a while since I really put any time into this, but really working those legs up super high for the triangle, and this is what we want to see. This aggressive wow. passing to kill a whale, smashing through straight into <laughs> half guard here. And look at that shoulder pressure, it's super tight. I think we're seeing the killer whale come out. Yeah, yeah. absolutely, I think so. You're going to see possibly this knee cut straight into the full mount position. And Ella Dorkin underneath doing everything she can to try and get some frames on the face here, possibly to invert and try and open up some space on the inside, but... Killer Whale just needs to bring that knee through. He needs to try to work it uh, through. I've just come over to the mount or come to the side there. She goes, bring the knee to the side. It's possible she'll have to try to get to the mount here. There it is. There it is. Strong position here for the Killer Whale, Mali Costa. And early on as well, she's got three and a half minutes. A great job by Ella Dawkins to get back into that half guard. And I think this is what we're going to see in a really, really tight, strong position here. Maddie did say that her favorite technique is the knee on belly to arm bar. So maybe, I mean, possibly see uh, maybe a guard pass from this half guard into side control that opened that, up that option, maybe into mount and then dismounting into an arm bar. That looks like some pressure. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? I mean, I feel like with a, the name, the killer whale, whale. you've got to be, you've got to be heavy on top, right? Oh, so <laughs> I mean, far side Americana by the looks of it, and living up to the name there. Hopefully, we'll get a, we'll get a replay there. And, I mean, look at the, look at the sportsmanship, and the maturity from these two very young actors. I mean, fantastic. And, um, Manny Costa is absolutely beaming there. We're going to have a look at some of these replays. This was early on. This sweep attempt by Ella. You know, had some really, you know, was, was working really, really nicely early on from that guard position. But as soon as, as soon as Ella got to, uh, sorry, as Mali got to this uh, half guard position, it was just pressure, pressure, pressure the entire time. Hopefully we can get an angle. No, that's the far side of this. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming an Americana on the far side here yeah. is beautifully done. Yes. So, ladies and gentlemen, your winner, by submission, Mali Costa! First, first submission of the night, fantastic performance, just 11 years old, and you know, we could well be looking at the future of UK grappling right here, right now. Hopefully we'll be able to see, I mean, this is one of the best things, the sportsmanship spoke 